Okay then. Ring ring. Hey Val. Hello. Hello. Okay, let's try this screen share thing. Okay. Which I do by pressing buttons. Oh, that title card on the stream is really nice. Isn't it? Yeah. Little Shy side. is pretty awesome. <laughs> oh, Skype, why can you never make things make sense? Share a window. Pop oh. Chat. Oh, here right. we go. We'll keep the stream open for now, but I will close it so I'm not wasting bandwidth if the screen share works. Screen share! Ah! Oh, this is terrifying. A thing. Oh, I see a thing. I see All right. a game. Hey, it's yeah, it looks like it's working. Yeah. So you should get the video on time and not with the Twitch delay. Okay, try booping the menu with boops and see how it times up. Okay. Um, hold on, I guess I should say. Okay, I'm on start right now. Yeah. <laughs> Down to Hello. quit. Yep. Up to oh, start. That's, that's really fast, yeah. Oh, Perfect. that's beautiful. Hey. Yes. Hello. I'm hey, Val. Shy. Hi. What was Hi. that? Sorry. Oh, I'm Val. Hello. Hi, Val. I think I've Hi. seen you in the chat a lot. I'm yeah. Shy. Shybert. You did the title card stuff for the Dino Crisis. Yeah, that was me! That was me. <laughs> oh my god. I'm not gonna lie. My... <laughs> you sound I like you were running. I was. <laughs> my mom wanted to see the stream, and I was like, eh, it's not like we're doing anything raunchy. So <laughs> I directed her to your channel. <laughs> And then oh, I was no. like, yeah, we're going to be playing this game. We're going to be marathoning. And then I hear your voice start going. And I'm like, and I'm late and missing it. So, oh, no. so I ran up the stairs and was just like, oh, God. <laughs> it's okay. You okay. made it. I made it. I'm here. We all made it. <laughs> Low to chat if they can hear me. Yeah. You I don't know. Um, oh. I got to get to your Twitch channel. <laughs> um, so, obviously, I will need you two to uh, do a little bit of chat relay for me as well, because I'll be focusing mostly on the game. <laughs> yes, absolutely. Let's see here. Oh, this butterscotch cinnamon pie. Oh, I'm so <laughs> I jealous. I could eat the whole thing. I'm so jealous. Same. Don't worry, when you wake up tomorrow, there will be a piece beside your bed. <gasps> You are, you are Toriel. You know, we were saying you were Sans <laughs> earlier, but you're actually Toriel. That's true. <laughs> but I hate children, so I don't you... know how that would work. <laughs> so are you actually Flowey, then? A <laughs> little bit of everything. Howdy! <laughs> I'm your best friend. Oh, God. <laughs> You'd actually be a pretty good voice for Flowey. <sighs> okay. I All think right. I've caught my breath now, so that's it's nice. Still, I can't believe this is still version 0 0.1, but it's actually the complete game. Oh. Hmm. This, how long has, when was Yume Nikki even made? I want to say like 2008 at the latest, but it's probably even earlier than that. I remember Let's the, see. the summer of 2008. 2008. <laughs> <laughs> I don't know. It was a good year. Hello, um, Venom and Shadow Mark and Graceful Motion. Hello, I'm All you early birds. Screen. Early birds. We just sitting and letting people kind of grasp on everything. Yeah, I'm gonna give it another minute and then mm -hmm. start the game. Oh my but... god, this game was made in 2004. <laughs> oh oh gosh. wow. So I was all. 14. <laughs> So long ago. <laughs> That's too long. Let's forget about that. That's too long ago. Okay. That's, like, That's 11 yes, years. <laughs> let's, let's not focus on that. <laughs> uh, this will give me a little bit of time to go grab my tea, so I will be right back. Mm. Alrighty. Hello, Daiki. Yeah, it's not Isaac. Yeah, not Isaac. Even though 
I do love the Binding of Isaac, but... Yeah, I heard Afterbirth is supposed to be pretty damn good, too. Like, mm -hmm. um, I mean, you know, Ed, Edmund McMillan, everything he makes is pretty much gold, so <laughs> I'm not surprised, but... One thing that did surprise me is people are saying the music is really good. And not to say the music was bad in the Isaac games, just kind of not... It wasn't... It didn't stand out that much to me. Ha have you played the new one at all? The, uh... No, I haven't played After Birth. Mm-hmm. It's... I... <sighs> yes, I think it's called... Yeah, yeah, it is. It's, um... I said Rebirth earlier, and people corrected me. Yeah, I think Rebirth was the... <sighs> this... It's... Yeah. I'm confused about all the names, too. I'm not the most avid Isaac player, but... The music is really good for the new one. It's fantastic and layers upon layers, and it's like reactive to the environment too. It's an entirely mm. reactive soundtrack. It's really cool. He did a bunch of stuff on his Tumblr about it. I'm gonna check out his Tumblr. Is it mm -hmm. full of like really creepy, disgusting art too? Yeah, he he also he like All reblogs, right. he even reblogs porn of his characters sometimes. <laughs> <laughs> he has no filter. It's actually awesome. It's refreshing to see somebody so honest like he just he does not give a shit and he doesn't have to <laughs> like you know what you're getting into yeah he's like you follow me this is what you get his icon is a, like a little naked picture of himself pooping so that's <laughs> yes like, i've seen that if you get that far you know <laughs> anything goes i am back and i have tea and hey. a very autumn-y blanket nice myself in <laughs> <laughs> Ooh, I might have to grab the blanket as it gets later in the night. Mm -hmm. Okay, let's get this started. Yes! My room. Get in bed. Dream. Wake up. Very that's, simple. That's the game flow. <laughs> that's the game. That's pretty much all there is to it. I kind of want to see more games do a little chart of the game flow like that. Yeah, it's really cute. Yeah, I'm not sure if I've seen it anywhere else. I can't think of anywhere else. I mean, it's functionally a tutorial that takes, like, five seconds to <laughs> understand completely. <laughs> and there's Marotsuki! Yeah, <laughs> she's so cute. I love her little footstep sounds. Oh. You can go on my balcony, and it's kind of dark, creepy sky, but also soothing in a way. Mm-hmm. That's kind of this game in a nutshell, really. Yeah. More or less. Gloomy, Also, is soothing. this like a gym bar? Am I supposed to do pull-ups here? Think I think it's like... hang clothes on that? Yeah, uh, it's like a clothes That would rack. make sense. Like mm -hmm. a dryer. Uh, I forget, like, outside of North America, people don't use dryers that much. Yeah, no, it's... They're kind of power-hungry. <laughs> yeah, it's like, kind of the same as leaf blowers. Really, <laughs> really wasteful. Functional, yeah. but barely functional. <laughs> Let's play some Nasu. Yeah! The original Flappy Bird. <laughs> <laughs> oh my god. <laughs> 2004, <laughs> Kikiyama. Uh. So I gotta, yeah, I gotta jump, because then I open my mouth. Oh, no! Oh, mm. you only eat on one eggplant! Yeah, I'm pretty bad at this game. <laughs> <laughs> oh, I hope it doesn't do the thing. Oh no, okay, I can't exit. They fixed it! Yay! <gasps> oh, that's nice. You Let's give it one more support. shot. I might have just not been holding escape before. <laughs> oh, do I'm you gonna say it was deck? probably user error. Yeah. Oh, Attack. yes! You know what this really reminds me of is, um, the game that Pixel made glasses for your guy who's try. Oh no! Trying to catch oh, no. falling glasses. It over and over? Me. That sounds like yeah. a version of hell. Like, he just <laughs> constantly has to catch his glasses. It reminds me of a typing tutorial game I played for school years and years ago. Oh, I remember that. Probably it's... around the time this came out, you played as, like, like, a Tukon, and you had all the to right catch... Type? I think you had to catch, like, different fruit that had punctuation in it, depending on where the punctuation <laughs> went. It was really tacky and... That sounds silly, but cute. Mm -hmm. You know, video games. We're gonna play video games in class today. Mm -hmm. You're like, 
Yay! In, your sh in this video game, you learn. No! Can I play Jedi Knight? God. <laughs> oh, don't give me flashbacks to playing Star Wars multiplayer stuff like 10 years ago. It's too far. <laughs> it's too far away. This is my life, by the way. I go to That's sleep it. and then dream about going to bed. Same though. That, that is perfect. Oh. Hello, Liz. Hey, Liz. Oh, um. Oh, shoot. There's a way to, to like, wobble around on your chair that I can't remember. Yeah. Wobble yeah. around? Yeah, you can. Oh, yeah, like, there we go. There you go. can floop around and scoot. Yeah. And do a scoot. Mm -hmm. So slow. <laughs> have you uh, have you done the glitch before? Yes, where it makes you go super fast. Yes, <laughs> we'll probably be using that later because the one thing about Marutsuki is she moves very slowly. Yeah, yeah. even with the witch's broom. Even then, yeah, she's pretty. Oh, hi, hi. Creepy eye. Creepy watching me. Hello. All right, let's go into the dreamscape. Yeah. I love. I love the weird kind of as I, I, like I want to say Aztec, but I don't know the actual influence. Just like um, the art in the backgrounds is so yeah, funky. Cool. Yeah, whatever it is, it's a mandala because it's just flipped four times to make like a pattern into a circle. Oh, okay. <laughs> you draw one quarter of it and then you flip it down and flip it to the right twice and then oh, you know it makes that's a circle. Super clever. Yeah, you never made those in school. Mm, I think the closest thing was like folding paper and then, you know, cutting out sections to make snowflakes, quote unquote. Oh, yeah. <laughs> that's <laughs> actually, that's not too bad of like a way to think about it. Okay, um, I need some help deciding which door to go in first. I like the robot eye door up near the top. Robot eye door? Oh, yeah. Oh, that one. Hal. <laughs> that's the Hal door. He's yeah. got like the big mouth. Mm. <laughs> it's her head. That's a little disturbing. <laughs> <laughs> oh, I remember this. The zippers. Yeah, and, uh, we're in Zipper Town. Yeah, I think the zippers the numbers. little oh, what are they called? I want to say Nosferatu, but I know that's not it. <laughs> it's not Nosferatu. It's some think... weird long name for the girls with the pigtails. And, um, oh, um, that chase you around with. Yeah. yeah. They're scary. Yeah. And Little I think beats. this is the secret zipper when you get the knife. So we'll be coming oh, back to that. Oh, yeah. Yeah. Do these numbers ever mean anything? Nope. Well, this is just, I think this is called the numbers world. So it's just kind of <laughs> like thing. the backdrop. Yeah. That's the binary. Now we've entered right? binary town. Oh, one, oh, oh, one, oh, one, oh, one, oh, one, oh, one, oh, one. Oh, one. <laughs> <laughs> the newest that is, uh, that is the binary dance hit club single club hit single how do you say that <laughs> no problem. I don't know hit the club I Only never once. hit the club I would never hit the club I don't belong <laughs> no same clubs are yeah. noisy and they've got too mm. many people I would probably get a migraine <laughs> <laughs> oh Tur Turingen I Turingen that's what it is thank yes, you Daiki yes. Thank you, Toringen. Why did I think it was like Nosferatu? That doesn't sound anything like it. <laughs> I just it's remembered it was on the brain. kind of similar to Tengu. Tengu, yeah. Because they've cause got like almost bird-like bird, faces. The bird features, yeah. What about Pingu? <laughs> also Pengu. <pretty> Pengu. <laughs> <laughs> the most disturbing children's show. <laughs> That. What about that Mark Twain cartoon, with, like Claymation, where they see the devil? Oh, Jesus, don't remind me that. What was that? <laughs> it was, I think they called him the Mysterious Stranger, but it was this Claymation horror. It's on, it, it's like, there's GIFs of it all over the internet. I bet uh, I can find one. I remember seeing one where it's like some woman goes to hell and comes back because she was missing her handbag or something. And that one scared me a lot as a kid. <laughs> uh, There's oh no, Shadow Mark. The hash slinging slasher. The slash hanging slasher. Slash hanging. The sash ringing. Dash bringing. 
Oh, there's the short lamp. There it is. Also, there may be, uh, I remember the music to this spot. I can't hear it right now, but it's... Lovely. Haunting. Who's, who's uh, that in there? I love that so much. This, there's no point to that except to creep you the hell out. Yep. Well, it's a dream. It Dreams is a dream. don't usually have points. <laughs> That's, like... I don't know, I've always been really into dreams and like just how weird they can get and this game just emulates that so perfectly and I think that's why I one of the reasons I love it so much my dreams are never like this my dreams are like if you took something like Soma but then <laughs> someone was constantly fiddling with the timeline and the rules of it and making it more and more disturbing to be in <laughs> oh boy that's, that that's great. kind of what my dreams end up being like. So it's like Soma and Memento mixed into one. Yeah. Somento. <laughs> Moma. Moma. <laughs> yes, it's my dreams are the museum of modern art. <laughs> I thought you could like turn these lamps on and off. Like... You can turn, did you get the item? No, I'm still trying to find the effect in here. Yeah, I haven't must been be. doing my my good strategy. Wait, there's a lamp that's off down there. Go down. Hey, there are a few. Down here? That one's off. Yeah, there are a few of them that are off, but I thought you could like switch them. Yeah. Maybe you have to be one of them. Yeah, maybe I have to be a lamp. Maybe. I don't know if we're trying to do spoiler free or not. We we've all, I think, played this game before, the three of us probably. I've not played too much of it. I got no. to some weird spots, though. I made it to, like, the house with the girl in it. I made it that far. Oh, nice. Okay, yeah. That's in pretty... the snowy world. Yeah, yeah, that's pretty good. I've, um... Ugh, I've been obsessed with this game for ages and ages. <laughs> I need to... I've... Oh, go ahead, sorry. <laughs> no, Dead it's stop. fine. I don't like to. I don't like to interrupt. Just um, for me, because I'm a designer, I just I really love the whole look and feel of this game. Like, it's essentially an exploration game, and <laughs> you don't really fight anything. Sometimes you run away from stuff, but in the end, it is just an exploration game. But the art style and the general mood keep people interested and keep make it an amazing game to play yeah so almost purely from aesthetic it's um that's why it's so famously popular <laughs> and i think that's really really amazing there's actually been quite a few games kind of in this vein <gasps> that have done a lot of neat oh, things there is. oh there he is there he is okay yay my phone went off but like <laughs> This is just kind of like almost lackadaisical or lackadaisical with how it does things, but there's been quite a few games that have come out that have been very distinctly arty. Mm -hmm. One kind of almost literally so called Gallergy, where you. It's like a three Gallergy. Unity thing where you wander around and you go into paintings. Oh, like, like uh, Bubsy visits the James Turrell retrospective. Exactly like that. <laughs> I'm sure it's exactly like that. Nothing can no... be more artful than Bubsy. <laughs> <laughs> There's no dialogue. It's just you click on a painting and the color scheme and music of the entire world changes and it spawns in enemies and a Ooh. thing you have to find and you sort of navigate through sound. And I've heard it's sort of meant to be a metaphor for experiencing art in a gallery and like finding other people who connect with it, I guess. I don't know. Oh, and it, like, kind of changing or uh, giving you new perspectives? Mm-hmm. It's actually interesting. Like, there's that game, and then there's Eve, which both kind of Eve. explore galleries. They do. Galleries. I... Eve is another one of my favorite. Isn't... I think I recommended that one to you, AJR. You did, yes. And I because... checked it out, and I'm like, oh my god, this is fantastic. <laughs> exactly. <laughs> it's it's that same kind of aesthetic feel with Yumaniki, and it, it's so... I think there's a lot more gameplay and story elements to Eve, though. Like, there's almost... Oh, yeah. Oh, yeah. 
there's functionally there, like there's functionally no story to to Yumeniki except for what you discover while you're exploring. So <laughs> it's it's a dream journal. Exactly. That's the title of the game. Yeah, exactly. <laughs> <laughs> and uh like to be fair, this was kind of the forerunner for games of this type. Hmm. Was it the first? I'd say it was the first. It's definitely the first I know of. That I know I mean, of. Yeah. Shima was... also mentioned LSD Dream Simulator, which is on the mm-hmm. PlayStation, and that yeah. has a lot of similarities to this, but I've <laughs> never actually played it myself. Yeah, I don't think I played that one. And then there's weird stuff like off and space funeral and... Yes. Those are... I almost look at those as... Almost They're more traditional different. RPGs. They are yeah. more traditional, like Art. with the battles and everything. Mm-hmm. I, I've been rewatching LPs of um, Middens and Gingiva. Yes, Middens, that one. Middens, yeah, yeah. Middens yes. and Gingiva, which is the the sequel kind of. <laughs> okay. But, I still um, like to play those games. And uh, they... sluggish moors and things like that. Hmm. I think is that all the same guy? I don't think so. I think Sluggish Moors is oh, another guy, but uh, yeah, I... there's <clears throat> so many of those. Yeah, and I really like them all for different reasons. <clears throat> but for some reason, I feel like out of all of them, there's a, there's like Yumi Niki's really so- soft comparatively. Like, Off and Space Funeral are totally jarring <laughs> and really... Yeah. Um, rough in a good way but still very rough and Yumeniki even though it's got like these crazy color palettes there's still this softness to it <laughs> her little yeah. steps kind it's, of it's very cool you know? mm-hmm. yeah it's not scary exactly like, well, like Space don't Funeral it. is kind of out to just make you go what is even <laughs> happening <laughs> and off, yeah. what the fuck is any is, of this off is, is like a- French David Lynch, but this is just kind of... <laughs> French David Lynch. Well, yeah, it's like French surrealist art, right? Yeah, yeah. no, I, I absolutely think so. Mortis Ghost, the dude who does all the designs for that, again, hmm. I'm just gonna go off and about all the designs in these games. <laughs> That's what interests me, but he, in general, his, his art style is very surrealist, I think. Mm-hmm. Like, look at him. I've never seen that guy before. Who, who is he looks that? like like pinwheel sandwiches, almost. But he's got legs. Oh, he looks delicious. It's oh, what atom would that be that has three electrons? <laughs> um, well, there's hydrogen, helium, lithium. Okay. I think it's any of those. I'm going to be useless in this. <laughs> uh, I know nothing. <laughs> also, I think the scrolling background here is actually the exact oh. same map you're wandering on. I think. Yeah. It- is actually you could almost try and use it but oh yeah i agree xenomorph it's unnerving that's a good that's a good way to describe it unnerving and uncanny uncanny okay that's also a really good one oh right he's blocking the door he's blocking your way (laughs) you must two eyes there either the cat or the knife to get him to budge oh no Oh yeah, you can use the cat, can't you? Yeah. For the non-violent solution. I tend to prefer the pacifist to use... run. Yeah, I tend to prefer <laughs> to use everyone that I see have, that's played it kills my favorite character, and I'm like, you don't have to do that. <laughs> <laughs> Murder is entirely to... optional. You don't have to kill any, but and yet even I'm not sure if you did it, AJR, but I seem to remember maybe you did. I can't. I remember stabbing happening. I, I stabbed a lot. You <laughs> I was very knife happy. Very, very stabby. <laughs> and I was just watching well, like, oh, no! That's, that's also kind of a reflection of my own dreams, because they can get pretty violent, and I'm really? often the perpetrator of violence. Oh, uh, that's concerning. <laughs> well, dreams are way down. I don't know. Vent emotions, so... Mm. That's how our brains work through things when we're when we're I, yeah sort I information <clears throat> i haven't stabbed anyone in real life yet so that's good. That a good it's probably sign. yeah it's all those people you stabbed in yumaniki like you don't have to stab <gasps> people there, there we go it's a turingan there oh, hey, she there, is oh i think i think she's friendly we, 
We know she's a kid because she's wearing a striped shirt. Yes! <laughs> <laughs> Wonderful. Yes. Oh, yes. Also, I can you know, get into actually, one of these beds. You can. Is it the... There is one oh of them that you can. People this always... literal room in Undertale. Yeah, I'm pretty sure it's a reference. <laughs> you have to assume, right? I Holy knew I recognized what? it. Yeah. I didn't even until. You didn't think about it. <laughs> oh my god, that's it's that's amazing. So obviously, a huge reference. <laughs> but uh, <laughs> I would say I would not wish you to have the inverse of your dreams of stabbing people <laughs> like I do. Mm, <laughs> but that's a good point. Yeah. Do you get, do, do you get be stabbed decidedly in your unpleasant. dreams? Sometimes it's yeah. <laughs> Oh, there's the mad one. Oh mad yeah, mode. now now they're out. They're out to get yeah. me. Oh, nice. Hey, yeah. Oh, yes. Oh, I love that oh. effect. And I oh. love these these dressers oh, with the face. I never noticed the face before. Oh, there's a. <laughs> they they make a little stop noise too. When you're in the face. Oh, they do. They stop. For yeah, they stop for a moment, which is good <laughs> because they're catching up pretty quick. <laughs> Oh, I forgot this was like you had Oh to no, I don't want to get place. touched. Hi, Hi Oh my god. Hello, Onion. Oh, this is right behind me. <laughs> it's okay, they just want to take I... a walk with you. We're walking hand in hand. <laughs> You're like, hello. I... We just want to I... be friends. I forgive you for playing Payday 2 Onion. It was a very fun game. <laughs> <laughs> um, I swear there's oh. another way out of this room. And we should be careful not to no Undertale spoilers because oh, um, yes. I just yeah. to make it I think reference. that's fair. Yep. That's not a spoiler or anything, it's just an area. Yeah. This is a very, very small area. So like I keep it running is, into this. You're just looping, right? Yeah. yeah. Is um, it oh yeah, it's teensy tiny. Oh, I'm shy, Onion. Um, I'm a friend of Agent JR's. <laughs> I did the uh, the Raptor title card on his YouTube. Is that yes? Helps it's identify me at all. <laughs> Shai also did the um, the image I used for the YouTube announcement on this video, and what I'll be using for break time. Nice. Because... Oh, did you put that up? Yes, I did. I totally missed I, it. Thank you for suggesting it because I would have <laughs> forgot, and then people I... might have missed out. Yeah, I thought people might want to see. Oh yeah, that worked out good. Nice. How? I I can't even find the door I came in at. <laughs> I don't think I don't think you came. I think like, you might actually have to get caught to get out of this area. Yeah, I know you might in, be right. Because they teleport you. They don't they don't actually hurt you or anything. Yeah. Yeah. Like, you came in through oh, a door. Oh, here we go. Just sort of. Oh, there we go. That works. Oh, here's the bed I can get in. <laughs> oh, it's not time. It's not the it's right not time for that. Time. It's not time. People are saying I'm your clone, AJR. <laughs> <laughs> I'm down. If I had to be a clone, I'd be AJR's clone. Sure, let's go with that. <laughs> Ooh, is that Vampire the Masquerade Bloodlines or Redemption? I kind I of played like both. Play Redemption. Is there a new one? Uh, Redemption was the first one, I think. Was Redemption mm -hmm. the first one? Okay. Is it that... was the top-down kind of ARPG-style game. Oh, okay, yeah. Yeah. Like... I... yeah. It was neat, but mm. kind of flawed, like Bloodlines, I suppose. Yeah. <laughs> Though, I think... what was it? Some company bought out the developer of Bloodlines, actually. Oh? Or, I don't know if it was developer or the rights? But people are getting excited, like, oh, maybe we're going to get some more Vampire the Masquerade games, which I think would oh. be pretty cool. Yeah. I, I did think I heard that somewhere. That's why I was like, oh, is there a new one? <laughs> Paradox Shima. dead, says Shima. Ooh. Oh, thank you. Yeah, White, White Wolf. Wolf. That was it. Mm. Okay. But uh, speaking of games that are kind of dreamlike, there's one that I've always sort of interpreted as dreamlike, even though it's maybe not intentional, which is, uh, I, Divine Cybermancy. <gasps> I think that's totally intentional. I'm just gonna mm. say, from, like, from the extent that I've played that game, which, unfortunately, 
didn't translate to the YouTube series I did, but mm. uh, there's a lot of really surreal and dreamlike stuff going on. You just have to play a little bit more and pay attention to uh, character dialogues. Ah, uh, yeah, yeah. And, like, the, the looping thing. Yes. Oh, I is such an amazing game. Am I getting shivers just thinking about it? I want to <laughs> play it again. It's like, it sort of does some of the same stuff that Off does for me, but at the same time, it's mm. like mm -hmm. Ghost in the Shell meets Warhammer as a shooter. And it's really fun to just... That's so strange. I watched some of AJR's um, LP that he did about it. Mm -hmm. And I think it was just maybe the way it was shot. I, I didn't feel... Um, see that or feel that while he was playing it makes me really really interested in it yeah it's it, it's a lot more uh noticeable when you're playing it by yourself i think he did it co mm -hmm. uh, yeah i kind of yeah i pay, paid more attention to the action -y aspects of it because <laughs> it's text heavy and that kind of thing doesn't really translate well to videos unfortunately yeah i mean there, there's definitely ways I could do it, but I'm also, I just love to do nothing. So, <laughs> to do nothing. <laughs> Same. Who doesn't love to do nothing? <laughs> oh my goodness! I need to get out of this area. Cause speaking of doing nothing, okay, I'm just gonna wake up. Pinch my cheek. That's probably a good plan. <laughs> I love that you were a lamp and you like stretched out the glass. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> Yeah, the the translation for I was also not that great, which kind of yes. adds to the surreal nature. Oh, yeah, that it's fun like sometimes. Mm -hmm. I, I think, think they did an update of it, but at first oh, it was no. like you can't. Some of the dialogue was just complete nonsense. <laughs> <laughs> I and kind my of was like, way. no, I'm not leaving. I'm not leaving nope. my room. Uh uh. Have you ever had Monotsuki wake up with the crick in her neck? Yes, that scared oh. the shit out of me. Because I'm like, <laughs> what is going on? I love that. Sometimes Did I break you wake the game? Up for the chat, sometimes you wake up and Monotsuki's head is like permanently turned to the right, and you have to go back to bed to make it, and it's just she woke up with a crick in her neck, so like her head yeah. is all <laughs> crook-eyed to the side. Well, speaking of neck. I love the little wobble on the head. It looks like she's moving with her little braids, like their little arms. Like oh, if you yeah. walk forward. Oh, <laughs> Pushing God. herself along. I suggested a door last time, so I'll let Shy suggest one. Ooh, okay. Do a little run around. I'll pick okay. one. Let's um let's do the eyeballs down at the bottom ah, there. How did mm. I know you were gonna pick that one? <laughs> <laughs> Uncanny, isn't it? Mm. I love me some eyeballs. Oh no. Well, hey! this is the room for you. My oh favorite. no. I don't think I saw this room. Oh no. <laughs> <laughs> they're just hands. They're just waving, <laughs> saying hi. Hi this this is... Oh, hey, Dr. Tanner. <gasps> Tanner! How's it going? Glad to see you here, bro. <laughs> <laughs> Hello. That hand's waving too. It's like, hi, Tanner. <laughs> And say hello. I love those little eyeballs. They're just there's they look up like Hi. Hello. <laughs> I, I'm an eye. In, my, in my living room, I strung up from the ceiling. I bought like eyeball Christmas ornaments. They're like bloodshot eyeballs, and I, That's... I know they're doing double duty as Halloween decorations. And I'm gonna put them on my Christmas tree, and don't think I won't. Nice. Oh, that's fucking um, awesome. <laughs> so they're all hanging from my ceiling, and people keep running into them. <laughs> it's, it's my day. Shy, stop so, leaving your eyes all over the place. I'm sorry. People could just keep running into my eyeballs. You know, thinking oh. about it, it would be so cool to have the eyeball Christmas ornaments and then make intestine uh, tinsel to wrap around the tree. Yes. That would be just have, so awesome. Have uh, the goriest Christmas. I will. <laughs> Dude, okay, Krampus. Have you guys seen the trailer for Krampus yet? No, I don't actually do well with actual horror movies. Oh no! <laughs> well, it's a horror comedy. It's um... is that the one with Rowdy Roddy Piper? I'm not sure who that is. Maybe he was I in he uh, They Live. Yeah, it was his last his last role. Oh no! Yeah. Krampus is a brand new movie. 
um, that is just, it's a horror comedy that's set at Christmas, and instead of Santa Claus, this one family gets Krampus that comes, and I'm really looking forward to seeing it. There's lips. What? Oh! Hello! Oh, it makes a kissy! <laughs> 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 does nothing, but there you go. Really? It doesn't do anything? Not That's that surprising. I can tell. I was expecting it to eat me, to be honest. <laughs> <laughs> I can imagine that happening. Hey! <laughs> How about these guys? Nay. I like those guys. This really is, this is probably my favorite room. <laughs> Don't forget to do your squats! <laughs> oh, we've got a forest of hands. Yep. Uh, <laughs> hi, everybody. <laughs> I'm enjoying this, but I'm also squirming a lot. <laughs> <laughs> oh man, if you saw my thesis for uh, my last semester at college, you would die. Uh... I'm a very... I draw cute things, and then I also draw horribly disgusting things. <laughs> I Like, when it's fictional, I can handle it, but like, I'm one of those people who faints around medical things, so... Oh. <laughs> mm. Let's see, is there anything in the little forest of hands down there? I don't think so. Because isn't Nothing this the room see. where you get the hand item? Am I crazy? Oh, probably. But I, I gotta find... You reminded me now, I gotta find the hand with the eyeball in the palm. Yeah, I think that's <laughs> what it is. <laughs> oh, sorry, Liz, but wine is a good choice regardless. Mm. That's probably Unless what I would have picked. One of the options was rum and coke, in which case mm. it is the wrong choice to choose wine. <laughs> I thought I saw your question earlier, and I thought you were asking oh, someone else. Oh, he's <laughs> uh, Oh my god! I would hip. say yes, red wine for the Halloween hip. spirit. That's a uh, double entendre. <laughs> Halloween. Spirit. Oh, I got it. <laughs> oh. Oh. I'd that... say my hmm. only issue with this game is just... Oh my god. Oh yeah, it's getting a little, <laughs> little messy. We found it! Um. <laughs> they also make noises when you talk to them, but it's like really quiet. Is it? Yeah, we're not getting any of the noises. Uh. Oh yeah, because you're doing... Because mm -hmm. you gotta do the commentary, you can't actually listen. Mm -hmm. yeah. But it's fine. We'll make the noises ourselves. There's... They're not actually sad, these heads. Just, They're just kind of like, whoa, we're bleeding everywhere. That's wild. <laughs> <laughs> They're party ghosts. <laughs> yeah. Party ghost in it. Oh, that, that leg is making still some... going. He's making some distance. I didn't finish Dead Space 3. I didn't play any of the Dead Space games. The there it is. is. There it is. Hey, Metama. This is... Probably actually my favorite item. Are you surprised? My Probably not. Pokemon. Look how what? awesome it is! What? I oh, right! It. I forgot that brings you back. Yep, what? but you kind of wanted to do that anyway, because. Is there no other way out of this room? Um, you could have gone back to the door, but you kind of wound up in weird territory there, I think. It's the scrying eye. Scrying eye. That's such a good animation for when you move, just the little finger <laughs> wiggles. <laughs> Woibles? Woibles. <laughs> just woibling. Just woibling around. Oh, yeah, Whoa. and then there's this one. Yeah. She's like, That's not hey suspect there. at all. That, that almost looks like the symbol from Berserk. <laughs> Looking at it. <laughs> oh, by I... the way, uh, Undertale spoilers, did you know that Undertale is an anagram of Delta Rune? <laughs> <laughs> That's interesting. <laughs> Was that the door we came in? What was that door back there? That's... I think that's my way out, yeah. Is it? Okay. Because the door we came in is still there. Yeah. Um, just a lot of these rooms have second exits, but it can be hard to find if you're not scouring every square inch of them. Every little... yeah, you mm -hmm. almost and have to just... That was gonna be my complaint earlier when I kind of trailed off, just that you have to really methodically search these rooms, kind of... It's... It could Not be done the best. Better. Yeah, I can understand for a game made in 2004, it would be hard to. Oh. <laughs> <laughs> it 
it would be mm. it would be really hard to um make like a door randomly appear after a certain amount of time especially mm. an rpg maker like 2003 i think that's this is a really that, good point like cons yeah the technology at the time would not have been optimal so it's I love oh this my life. god onion what happened to you <laughs> that's... maybe i shouldn't touch this <laughs> <laughs> He's like, hey, no, that's All my right. nubbins. Do you want to go up or down? Uh, 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 the lamp. We're going up. Looks like we're going up. All right. Uh, getting so the footsteps are the end of the paths. Memories that... of Max Payne one. More nubbins. Zarf well. said up, so you went the right. You had made the right choice, AJR. Just but there was bring... nothing there. The, the blood trail dreams and Max Payne with the baby oh. screaming in the background. Those actually, I had to turn off my sound when doing those because the baby scream would just too much just ruin me. <laughs> and in the PC version, if you fell off, or no, it was in the Xbox version. If you fell off, it did the scream that was in the address unknown part, and that yes. scared the hell out of me. Oh, I feel that. Believe me. <laughs> I played those games extensively, so I got very acquainted with that scream. <laughs> <laughs> that little dancing, whatever that is. Dancing geometry, basically. Dancing geometry. Oh, and now I get to go yes. into what I dubbed the intestine maze. The intestine yes. maze. There's an image of this whole thing zoomed out, and it's really pretty to look at. Oh. <laughs> yeah, the sprite sheets and everything for this game are just like... Man, they're so good. It was like someone wanted to draw a bunch of dream surrealist imagery and just like used it a game as an excuse to do it. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> That's a good excuse. Yeah. I am down with that. Oh, Aren't this little guy here. Entrances. I like he looks like he's holding a cane. He's like, hello my honey, hello my <laughs> <laughs> Hello my ragram girl. <laughs> Baby, my gut's on fire. <laughs> uh, and my butt's a liar. And my butt's <laughs> I am glad that you chose to broke the si break the silence with that. That <laughs> truly worthy. <laughs> oh man. But yeah, there's like three or four ways out of this area, mm -hmm. and uh, yeah. I and had the hardest in. time finding one of them. I remember just charging through here on my bike, just trying to get anywhere. Just, I just love how you said that. Just charging through here on my bike. <laughs> my bike! I can't wait to find the bike. Oh, it's such a relief when you do. It's just, it cuts, it cuts down your travel time in like half. And that is the one, that's my one complaint about you and Nikki as well. It's just, they're, the levels are very hard to traverse and they're very slow to traverse. Yeah. yeah. And it's not like I want to, like, shorten the game an insane amount. I think that's a problem that games have nowadays, but, um... Being like, too short or too long? Too short. People, like, mm -hmm. they cut... Fun. It does depend on the game, because there are pacing issues in other, other games. Oh, games. Like... oh, hey! We, that looks familiar, yep. doesn't it? We are on the other path. On the other path. But yeah, there's some games are just way too short, and other games are Shadow of Mordor. <laughs> <laughs> uh oh. Oh, she's on to me. Oh no. I don't know if I'm gonna get through here. Make a break Make... for it! Oh! oh! Crap. <laughs> well. And I still get chills when that happens, even though I'm in a relatively I'm... small place right now. This is so scary. <laughs> Like, you, you're like, don't touch me, don't touch me, don't touch me! <laughs> Thankfully, I have this guy. He helps me out. Yeah. Uh, okay, let's pick a new door. Mm hmm Uh, I'm gonna choose this time, and I'm going with Disco Door. Disco Door! Whoop, whoop! It's, it's the meta door. Yeah. <laughs> this is, like, my favorite place, because the music is really upbeat, and there's a bunch of happy things just woobling around, and it's all flashy <laughs> colors. It's just great. Oh, I love that little guy up on the right. Now known as Wooblies. The little the guy that's freaking out. The, the neon worm? Or this no. guy who's like, yeah. <laughs> I like that. 
like little screaming onion. <laughs> yes. <laughs> and then the fire eyeball. And... I do like I like the fire eyeball. And, and unfortunately, the uh, you two can't hear this, but whenever I step on one of these tiles, it makes it makes a noise. Mm, I remember that. I remember that, and the different tiles make different sounds, or is that mm -hmm. a <laughs> Hi, Arctic! I... Hello! Oh, hey <laughs> uh, I I can't remember if it's this place or a similar one. Hmm. Probably is a similar one. For this which? Is just party Central. For you got a line of tiles that are all different uh, shapes and colors, and they all make different noises, so it's kind of a oh, little tune as you walk I along. I think it's connected to this area. Okay. That one reminds me of another school program, which was like, you painted pixels, but they were like, they had that effect and there were these instrument bugs that you would set on pads. So you Whoa. would make like MS Paint pixel art and the bugs would play music as they walked across it. That sounds really cool. And they were all magic. MIDI instruments. Huh. That sounds adorable. It was pretty great. I never <laughs> managed to make any actual music with it, but... <laughs> Get to see a little... Actually, I think these guys are my favorite. <laughs> you like them? They look yeah, like the, they remind the one-eyed of... pincer worms. Yeah, they remind me of earwigs, is what I was gonna say. Yeah! <laughs> hmm. Oh, did we loop back around? Maybe. Yeah, this is Maybe. looking... Oh. oh, and there's there's the arcade machine. Arcade <laughs> machine! I do like the arcade machine oh, yeah, quite a bit. Yeah, there's the door. And there's the door! What are those? Well, there's that one that looks kind of like a bag with a little <laughs> stringy coming out of it. To me, it looks like a can with a tongue coming out oh, of it. Oh, I see the can. I also see the bag. Hmm. Oh, yeah, he's like walking on his tongue. Yeah. Also, I'm I'm gendering everything as male, even though that's wholly incorrect. Yeah, I just I use little guy as a little <laughs> little guy. Yeah, little guy, little, little buddy, little buddy, <laughs> little buddy, exactly. my little buddy, <laughs> little friend. Take it from me, little buddy. <laughs> oh, and there's the special one here. They only show up once. Hey. Can I get neon. <gasps> You're partying now! Raver mod. I can change the color! Yes! This game is just magical. Sometimes it's dark occult magic that involves human sacrifice, but it's <laughs> magical. Sometimes it's neon disco dance parties. Mm-hmm. Oh! I never and found this. Pyramids. Oh yeah, these tiles also make a little woobly noise. Mm -hmm. And I realize now that this is where I grabbed the uh, the color inspiration for the drawing I did for the stream. Oh, nice! It totally is. Mm -hmm. That's awesome. Purple and red are my favorite. Some of my favorites, anyway. But well, magenta and Blue red and purples are all good colors. I too miss Windows Pinball. Ooh. When oh, when XP can't... first came out, I was like obsessed with that. Mm. I was playing that on Windows ninety eight. I don't think I ever did pinball. I had a Sega. I think I went straight to Sega and Sonic Spinball. Mm. So I oh, never nice. had a need for Windows Pinball. Um, I'm Shy Arctic, and there's Val here too. Hello. I'm MX Bun in or Mix Bun in the uh, chat. Mix Bun. <laughs> <laughs> it's like you you reach into a bun pile and grab a mix of buns. <laughs> Bun mix. <laughs> well, I found another entrance to here. Oh yeah, yeah, I thought there were multiple entrances to the maze. Actually, looking, the background's kind of purple in the maze too, isn't it? It looks almost black. <laughs> oh, it changes, it's, it's the neon. Yeah, it's because like... of my neon. <laughs> yeah. So I think if I take that off... It yeah, is Yeah, it goes black. back to okay. proper black. I'm not crazy. I was like, what is going on here? I wouldn't go that far. <laughs> oh, I'm a little crazy. <laughs> We're all a little crazy in here. Just, a, just a little bit. <laughs> just a touch. Just a little bit. Crazy. <laughs> <laughs> Goblin also, Scooby Doo, apparently. 
<laughs> I'm not going to. Your turn, Val. Your turn. Uh. <laughs> oh. My face is my blanket. Is the maze called Hell Arctic? I didn't know that. I think it is actually. Really? This isn't oh. what I'd pick out as Hell out of the game. I wouldn't pick this area. I mean, playing it. <laughs> it's <laughs> Confused and... Oh, it is so confusing. It is. I'm actually useless at mazes. Just useless. I have no sense of direction. Mm, same. Dead ends! <laughs> yep, they're everywhere. Mm -hmm. You know, a good item for this game would have been an item that, like, let you lay down little breadcrumbs behind you so mm. that you could tell where you'd been before. Mm -hmm, mm -hmm, mm -hmm. That would have been a really cool effect. You could it could have been breadcrumb. Like you could have gotten breadcrumbs and then wherever you walked. Or like you turn your head into a loaf of bread and then just pick off pieces as you walk. Oh <gasps> that would be so cute! <laughs> it could be like a little melon pond, like melon bread. <laughs> ah we should oh. all come up okay, everybody in chat too, everybody should come up with effects that they think should be in the game. Oh yeah. Turn like, I think that's turn a into great like idea. A little... Dragon Quest slime thingy and leave a little trail, or like a snail. A little snail leaving a trail? Oh, yeah? That would be really cute, too. But Just no put a just... shell on oh. Madoski's back? Mm -hmm. yes. Or a little, like, little eye stalks out of her head. <laughs> <laughs> oh, is poop hair in this game? I thought that was in Dot Flow. Nope, maybe... it's in this game, too. Oh, no. Oh, snap. Because Flocky so... just said that you can leave flies behind with it. That's kind of oh! markers. Oh! I didn't know. I thought poop hair was useless. <laughs> so did I. I mean, aside Does from really being like... awesome, because you got poop hair. Because you got poop hair. This is amazing. Out of I had no body. idea. <laughs> I well then, it should be my mission to try and find poop hair. Poop hair. Poop hair. Poop hair. <laughs> The French poupée. The French poupée. It's like poupée, but air. <laughs> <clears throat> oh, I tired of this maze. <laughs> Put your hand on the left wall. <laughs> Which left? Who's left? Because it's. I'm the only one left. There's only yeah. Marutsuki. Okay. Here we go. Are you Wait, guys what still is the effect name again? Mara something? Mara Metamod. Metamod. Extremely useful. Good. Oh good. I can you, was I fuzzy at all for you guys a minute ago? Because my video went all fuzzy and voices uh, went robot-y. You weren't fuzzy, but the visit the video went a little choppy for me for a minute, but it's better now. Okay. Yep, we're all fixed now. That's good. Okay. I was wondering um, if it was me or if it was just a little hiccup in Skype. So. Also, you missed a very loud sneeze. <laughs> no! <laughs> missed or it was muted <laughs> and hidden from me. <laughs> it was hidden. Uh, okay, chat. First person to pick a door picks a door. Oh. Pick a door. Any door. Pick a door. Any door. You can even <laughs> give, like, uh, clock clock numbers if you want. Even though it, they don't quite line up to that. Maybe it's more fun if you guess what they mean. <laughs> like, that that could like be the, true, too. The descriptions of the doors. Blue. Someone said blue. Okay. Uh, said uh, blue. I see purple. I see all purple. Maybe the I'd say one? this is probably the bluest door. I'd say that's the purplest door. Yeah. I'd say this is the, the purplest door. That's no. the bluest door. That's the bluest door. What? And then the Am second I... bluest is the lower left. Yeah, Am I that losing one. it? Yeah. Okay, someone said red brick. <laughs> but wait, there's two red bricks. There's no, I think two. I think they mean this one. The other one's pink. <laughs> okay, this is like the argument my sister and and I had over a sweater that I own. I was like, it's orange. She's like, it's red. And neither of us would budge. Is neither it, would it, see. To this day, it's still either orange or red, depending who you ask. <laughs> it's like the dress that was all over Twitter a yes. few months ago. <laughs> the white exactly. and gold dress. <laughs> the blue and black dress. Yeah. 
<laughs> my mistake. My god. And then people were like getting getting all defensive and being like, oh, it people was... who see it the other way are just stupid. Blah, 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 blah. It, it got so ridiculous. You yeah. know, it's 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 all moot anyway because all monitors display color differently. All of them. And two, humans have different amounts of cones in their eyes to see with, so everybody sees color differently anyway. It's There's yep. also an optical illusion. People were also pulling pranks. I know. <laughs> <It's> like... <laughs> oh, and then there's the trolls. Oh, Always the trolls. trolls. But yeah, Just... like, perception is all relative. Nobody there are also is people any who more have... right. There the are other. also people who have a third type of nerve in their eye and can see more colors than everyone else. I actually have that. Whoa. <laughs> I took that test. Oh my god, that's... That makes you ideal to be a designer. <laughs> yeah, I think that's actually why, like, people... I will tell people something's purple when they're saying it's blue. I'm like, that is lavender. You are crazy. <laughs> <laughs> that is a shade of purple. And uh, it's been that way forever. And then I realized, I'm like, oh, I'm one of the freaks that has... Like, can see extra color. <laughs> it's not a freak thing, it's a neat thing. You're um, a mutant. The next I, step in human nope, evolution. Zarf is right. I'm a mutant. <laughs> <laughs> Technically, we all are. Technically, we mutate yep. over time. Mm. Like, even within our own life cycles? Yes. Your diet Whoa. apparently has a very infinitesimal effect on your DNA. Hmm. Whoa. So, this Reese's pumpkin that I'm eating... <laughs> is going to give you extra arms. Oh, I am dead. How many of these do I have to eat to get them to come back? <laughs> I mean, think of all the art you could do. Oh, <laughs> there's so much art! Get people to argue so you can steal their diamonds. <laughs> How do I get them to argue just because I have ex- Oh, it's oh, the color. These lamps I can turn on and off. Extra colors. First, you have to find people with diamonds, and then you have to make sure you're wearing the blue and or purple sweater. <laughs> make it a heist. And if you have extra arms, that would help you. Are diamonds completely, perfectly transparent? There are different kinds. There's a yellow diamond. Right, there's like different shades, because it depends on the minerals. And Just the... like quartz, yeah. Mm -hmm. And then there's also the cut that's important, because the right cut can induce total internal refraction. Mm -hmm. Which means there's... light enters and basically doesn't escape there, there's for very a really few, long time. There's very few diamonds that are just perfect carbon. Really onion. Onion yeah. looks black. Is it because they're coal? Well, And diamonds. all the other colors are uh, from other That'd be pretty effects. coal. Oh my god. <laughs> I'm See quitting the call. I'm out. <laughs> All right, talk to you later. Thanks Bye. for coming. <laughs> no, no, no. Look, I can spin my umbrella. <laughs> I actually love doing that. I completely missed that. <laughs> I was just doing that while you were chatting. Just oh wandering through this area, getting umbrellas. I used to try doing that, and I'd always whack myself in the head with little spindles on the inside of the umbrella. Oh, those are the worst. <laughs> I'm always afraid of, like, maybe I shouldn't even say that but the spindles have always concerned me. <laughs> That's really foreboding. <laughs> the spindles. Like, That's leaving it concerned. up to imagination is even worse, I think. <laughs> um, then <laughs> I'll just stick with that. All the more reason to. <laughs> okay, I'm gonna put my umbrella away. Mm, extra arms And, and instead, eat. also put my body away. <laughs> <laughs> Let me just put my body away here. <laughs> That's um, a really disturbing image I just got. <laughs> Xenomorph said that extra arms mean more arms to hold guns to rob the diamonds. So yes, mm. I need to both have I. Okay, I already have the color seeing power. Now I just need the arms. You saw the the no arms mod, but now there's the extra arms mod. <laughs> <laughs> oh my god! Like that the trick reload in I think it's Battlefield Hardline, what? where an extra <laughs> arm comes off screen to hand you a magazine. <laughs> <laughs> they like programmed in a one in ten thousand chance for a reload to be a special goofy animation. 
Oh my god. And there's like one where the, the person has a desert eagle, and then they go to reload it, and like they kind of do magic hands, and it disappears, and then they like look at their hands, and they're like, where did it go? And then pull it out from behind their ear, point at it, like, yeah, there it is, and go back <laughs> shooting. <laughs> it is just magical. <laughs> oh, I gotta get some coins so I can use that vending machine. That means you need the knife to kill people. Oh Are yeah, really? that is how you get coins. Oh. Yep. Sad times. Mm. Um. Let's walk this lonely forest road. This is always the scariest part for me. <laughs> it's also got some pretty foreboding ambience. Mm. Well, we can't hear that, so it's not as bad. <laughs> yeah, but I just remember this always being very tense. It is, for some reason, a totally abandoned road is very... I love that the chat, they're all diamond obsessed. Yes. The diamonds chat is now diamond. Diamonds are the chat's best friend. <laughs> <laughs> chat, you're perfect as you are, as a diamond. Oh, chat, you're all diamonds. Diamonds this, in the rough. This place also reminds me of Warcraft 2. Which I played oh, very I can see that. as a kid. This is like... The only thing I remember of Warcraft is trees. Mm hmm Trees and blood and s that turned into skeletons and the orcs making funny noises. Like, don't cut that thing. <laughs> <laughs> oh, bye-bye, Arctic. Have a good night. Happy Halloween. Yeah, right. later, Flocky. We'll see you. Pizza. Hmm. I had pizza earlier. Oh, pizza sounds good. Why'd you... Why? Because pizza always. Yes. <laughs> always pizza. Always pizza. <laughs> <laughs> that sounds really good. Oh, are I you mean, gonna be okay? Do you, no, do you need, I'm <laughs> Do we need a pizza fund? Oh <laughs> no, no, no. I all I've eaten is sweets today, so I think I'm just craving something like some salt to something balance it out. Salty, yeah, just something. <laughs> well, earlier today. This tree's different. That's that's because it's a lamp post. Oh, the no, other there's. Tree. <laughs> yeah, there's like this right beside it. But it, there's also a lamp post there. That's, that's very true. Because that's a lamp post, David. <laughs> Why does this tree glow at the top? Why are you looking at chat, Shima? Oh, it's the animation. Shima linked the animation in the chat. Hmm. Which animation? The one you were talking about, I think. The claymation one? Reload animations. Oh. oh, okay. Yeah, the Battlefield Hardline special. Yeah. Easter eggs. Yeah. They're pretty good. I recommend watching that. If, mm -hmm. Well, I mean, once the stream's over. <laughs> Stream bot Don't you dare look away for even a moment. <laughs> yes, Val's, Val's pizza. pizza. Making everyone jealous. We now all want pizza. Thanks. Val's pizza. I, I because your life about, is hollow. I, I and it would be better with pizza. <laughs> you just pizza. Never... You crave pizza. Your life is meaningless without pizza. <laughs> <laughs> oh. Flower dances when I talk to it. Oh. oh. See, I Ding. thought that was a jellyfish. Mm. You know, it could be a jellyfish, too. Maybe. It looks kind of like Shiren. Yeah. Shiren? Shiren has always confused me because her body seems to be a separate entity from the rest of mm -hmm. her. Hmm. You do not I have, have any privileges, you know. <laughs> <laughs> oh yeah, because it's because it's no links because of spam bots that have been botting the spams. Yeah, botting the spam. Um, oh, you know, I did eat something a little savory earlier today. I was, um, I did this kind of Halloween thing where I went to the store and I picked out really gross looking food. And then I came home and I jarred it and I poured chicken broth in it so they look like preserved specimens. <laughs> awesome. <laughs> That's what I spent my morning doing. So I did have, it was like a vegan apple sausage. Apple sausage? It was weird. It doesn't taste like mm. apples. It tastes like sausage and oh, a little whoa. bit of maple syrup. Uh, <laughs> I don't seem to be no, getting anywhere on this road. Mm. I the opposite of spam, spam zarf. I ate vegan sausage. 
I I saw someone once say that spam was like meat tofu. I don't, cause it's made of meat though. Well, yeah, but They're it's made like, out of meat. But it's 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 like this... oh, like meat tofu, like yeah. If meat was, uh, no, if tofu was meat, it would be spam. Oh, <laughs> <Yes>. okay. <laughs> Yes. I, that took me a minute. I was like, but the very purpose of tofu is to not be meat. <laughs> <laughs> I forget. If, if you walk to the left, it loops forever. If you walk to the right, you can go to I a new place. I was waiting for you to do it. I was not going to say anything. <laughs> <laughs> Thank I you. I, I appreciate how, that. See how long it took. <laughs> oh, there's these, these things. The things from Neon like... Genesis Evangelion. Oh, yeah. That's what they are. That's that's totally what they are. Didn't you mention that in my first stream of this game? Or like comment in the video? I didn't. I this, might have. I would swear you said that before. <laughs> Probably. I'm reusing jokes. It's been so long since I've seen Ben Gillian. <laughs> <laughs> okay, so think think about what you're doing. Think about what you're doing, AJR. I know what I'm doing. I gotta walk through the screen a few times and then go back. Or no, I gotta keep mm -hmm. walking. Mm -hmm. You gotta keep going. <laughs> yeah, yeah, exactly. Hi, Day's Blade of Lies. Hello, Day. Oh, Dayblade! Holy shit, it's been a while, dude. Dayblade. They are a little a lot late. <laughs> Just a little lot. Excuse my sniffliness. You are excused. <laughs> Oh, I can't remember. I've got to just is not keep going like this way. The others. <laughs> is this guy? No. One of these things is not like the other. <laughs> this one's kind of fat. It's like, <laughs> brrr, I ate too much spaghetti. <laughs> I know that feeling. <laughs> How can you not see which one is different? <laughs> well, I mean, there's also the short one. They all the look different one. to me. Oh, yeah, they're goodness. all like. There's a red one amongst all the. <laughs> There's a brain right Oh. Uh, <laughs> yeah, but... Can't what's your point? Anything. I'm pretty sure you have to get to him and then turn around? I could be wrong. Okay, I'll try that. Such a lonely road. Lonely, lonely road. Um, no, you're not forgetting me, Dayblade. I don't think we've met. I'm a friend of AJR's. Um, God. Yeah, Shy hasn't really been on the stream before, but she and I are good pals. Mm-hmm. We are. Oh, it's the green oh. one. Hey! I think that means he looked at me. He looked at you. Oh yeah. Okay. This is where I wanted to be. This is good. Mm -hmm. I think the first time people would have seen me would have been in the um the Desperate Gods LP on your channel. Yes. Um, mm, I want to play that sometime. It's so fun. We should totally play that sometime. We should play that. It's been ages, and it was so mm. fun. Um, other than that, no, I I haven't really been on stream or anything. I think we were talking about playing Don't Starve together at some point, but yes, we Don't Starve together, together. Don't Starve together. <laughs> together. <laughs> yes. Hello, Dayblade. So that's I can go down the the, the tongue tunnel, but. I know there's an effect just a little further up. Yeah. The code. Oh. Hey. Oh, I got stoplight. Sir. Oh, oh God. Too late now. <laughs> yeah, he could have really benefited from that. A little late. But yeah, I'm glad you. Uh, I'm glad you like those videos, sir. I had a lot of fun being in those. <laughs> <laughs> Delighted giggle. Stop. I just love the Go. little feet coming out from underneath. Stop. Go. Yeah. I I know many people who are very delighted by object head cuteness, so... <laughs> yes! Oh my god. Which... And I'm delighted by this guy. Look at how, yeah. happy. Look how happy he is. He's having <laughs> such a good time. He's like, yeah, yeah my climb my noodly arms! <laughs> oh my god, this And is now, good. I'm in the blank desert. Hey! Oh, my last reach is pumpkin, and there is no sign of new arms yet. Maybe you gotta sleep on it. It's uh, like it's like the Elder Scrolls game. You can't level up till you sleep. Um, but that's only in uh, Oblivion and back. Yeah, that's <laughs> true. 
I for oh, man, Where's I love this the guy. Art. It's uh, so cool. His their their eyeballs yeah. kind of just yeah. stretching out. They can see forever. Unidentifiable jiggly <laughs> bits. And this one's got jiggly jaw. Jiggly <laughs> jaw! And I can stop his jaw with the stoplight. Oh! Again, again gendering things. <laughs> Her. <laughs> She's a beautiful, stop. strong woman. That's true, yes. There you go. Stop. <laughs> All right, I can't actually do much here because Love um, <laughs> this is like the other great, side Sarf. of the desert. Let's do that. Onion oh, yeah, says, "Why are you suddenly playing off? What is this madness?" <laughs> <laughs> that is very off-like, isn't it? Mm. Oh, great! Right. I was gonna say something related to something we said like a billion years ago, but mm. um, there is an area in Off that's like the the wide open areas in this game where you have to just like basically walk a screen up and then go until it loops walk a screen up go until it loops i think that's where you find one of the um, one of the powerful artifacts like the grand meat or something i'm not i'm having trouble remembering but i do not doubt it at all <laughs> hi show josephine. hey josephine <clears throat> it's me about what a it's weird me about <laughs> Such beautiful grammar. <laughs> That's like when Val says thank. <laughs> thank. thank. Please thank. <laughs> you, you should see my Twitter. It's basically nothing but that. <laughs> Please. Thank. I don't want to go to bed. Okay, now I'll go to bed. <laughs> no, I won't go to bed. No. Yes, 24,000 20... people are watching this stream. <laughs> Wait, what? Really? Uh, wow. 24. 25 precisely. We just lost hey, one awesome. because they were offended, apparently, at 24,000. <laughs> they just wanted to prove Dayblade wrong when mm -hmm. Dayblade said 25, and they're like, hell no, quit. Mm -hmm. uh, I want to get the secret bed thing. It's going to happen one of these times. The, Who chooses next? The neck kink. I think chat um, should pick again. Okay, yeah. Um, okay, chat. Yeah, whoever picks first, pick a door. Any <laughs> door. Karyonic says, give or take 23,976. <laughs> <laughs> I mean, it's close enough, right? Close enough. Cyborg eye door. I think we went in that one already. We did. Yeah, that was the first one. I'm wondering... One. If you can do- wait, wait, wasn't there a dude blocking a door? Yes. Can you get him away with the stoplight? I don't think with the stoplight. I think you need the cat. Yeah, yeah. you're right. Dr. Tanner oh. says the checkered one on the left, and I don't think okay. we've been in that one before. Let's do that one. Hmm. <laughs> Day played. Uh, would that be this one? Checkered? That looks pretty checkered. It's a checkered door on yeah, the left. Yeah, it's definitely more checkered yeah. than the other one. I think that's the most checkered. And if we're wrong, sorry, Tanner. <laughs> you you decided on that whether you wanted to or not. Yep. Thank you for your contribution. <laughs> this is your choice now. <laughs> Live with it. Live with the choices you have made or not made. I like this door. Tanner gives two thumbs up. <laughs> Or yeah. Or two middle fingers. <laughs> no, that would be D's. Oh, those would be D's. God. B's are thumbs up, D's are flipping you off. Oh, I always just <gasps> knew it was B oh, so because bed had to look like a bed. That's how I knew as a kid. <laughs> it's because the word bed has to look like a bed. Bed. Oh my god! You're so right. <laughs> <laughs> Just had a light also, hi, Ian. Oh. oh, thanks, Tanner. <laughs> there it is. Same to you, buddy. <laughs> you should put on your uh, your hand head, and then we'll just say that that the hand okay. head is flipping Tanner off. <laughs> oh, oh, wait! Need I need the lamp because it's dark in, in here. In the darkness, in the darkness, that hand flipped Tanner off. <laughs> yes, definitely. <laughs> in the friendliest way possible, of course. Yes. Oh, the most well-meaning oh, middle finger. Hi to Ian. That looks like 
looks like a bed. What is this? <laughs> Tanner is now saluting, I think. <laughs> That's actually a really cute emote. I like that one. I like this version because it can also be a cat peeking around a corner. Oh! <gasps> yes. That's really All cute. these things I never <laughs> noticed. You were up, you're all opening up a whole new world to me. A whole new world. A whole new world. Let's not get into that. No. <laughs> get a, a copyright thousand strike. thousand really disturbing things to see. <laughs> <laughs> oh, little lamp. I forgot that it was totally dark in here. Yeah, it's just like pure coincidence that I happened to have the lamp equipped when I walked in. I know! <laughs> That looks like a really angry face. It actually looks like the the secretary from Monsters Incorporated. <laughs> uh, my, uh, my my child <laughs> with, with the smoker voice, right? <laughs> yes, that one. You'll see the face again when we loop around, probably. Oh, there he is! Oh, there he is! Get him! Snaps to look. Get him! Oh, stop late! Yes. Can the stop late help you? Oh no! Oh no! They follow me. <gasps> That's right. Oh! I make right. a ghost friend. But, um, yeah, my childhood gaming was basically He's... nothing but weird coincidences that I had no idea. There, were that's happening. the secretary face. Ugh. Yeah. Mm. Like I managed to unlock cheats for Mech Warrior Two by complete coincidence, just because I named all of the pilots after Calvin and Hobbes characters, and that turned out to be a cheat code. What? What are the chances? I had no idea, and then suddenly there were new mechs that I had access to, and I had no idea how. Holy <laughs> schmoly. to Blip lost their sheet. Hey, wow. Jared, did you see the video I made of me with my roommate Napstablook? <laughs> yes. I love that so much. I retweeted it, too. Oh, that's right. I forgot. I didn't. I, were, I didn't know you retweeted that. Actually, I remember you. I'm pretty it. sure I did, or I meant to. <laughs> okay, I gotta remember this door is here. It's like Skullhead door. Cause I think there's still an effect I can find. Perhaps the Blue isn't a spoiler. He's in, or they are in. Uh, the first. Good. He's in the demo, isn't he? Yeah. In I the tutorial that, area. I'm pretty it's sure that looks a he. I, no, I, everyone specifically refers to Naps to Blook as they. They? Yeah, especially okay. Even, even um, does. Yeah. Yeah. Everybody does? Okay. Yeah. Oh, I was thinking of Metaton. My, my mm -hmm. mom. Yes. They, Met Metaton, Metaton is a he. Mm -hmm. Yes. I think that's the... Oh, there oh, it I is. I can't link, because I'm not a mod! I was going to link no. the, the video. Maybe. That's right. Really? knife. You can put it in Skype chat, and then someone, like, the agent can link it. Oh, Ooh, that's fine. Right, yeah. these are hands. Hands! The knife is between the hands. Oh. Oh. Also, should I stab awesome. my ghost friend? I'm thinking that. Oh. No, Stop you did that okay. as, You did that in the LP Quit. and it made me so sad. Me too. Oh. We're yeah, here I, to won't. Prevent I won't. I will. Okay. We're preventing. <laughs> You'll tame we're my violent you. urges. We that, will. That's that's fine, Tanner. It's just kind of a bunch of people it hit really hard with, and they've been really, really loud about myself included. <laughs> yes. Um, Undertale just makes me feel really good all over. It makes me happy. It's what I want games to be these days, and they're not, usually. <laughs> it's funny you say that, because, like, I look at new RPG games coming out, and I'm like, what? This is just the same shit. Undertale showed us how it's done. <laughs> Stop making the same shit. Yeah. But no, very much so. not that I understand people can't why do not everybody like. would be into it. It's very, um, like, kind of, it's like a very specific target market, I think. Yeah. yeah. And to those people, it's like the best thing ever. <laughs> but mm -hmm. that doesn't mean it appeals to everyone, and that's totally fine. Yeah. Yeah. You can, you can not like things. It's all good. Isn't that just an amazing concept? <laughs> yeah. I've seeing people get that I know get bullied for not liking it or not being mm. able to play it properly and it's really sad. That is a crock of shit. That is mm -hmm. unacceptable. Those mm. people need to take a lesson from Papyrus. <laughs> <laughs> oh, man. I gotta find that door again. 
<laughs> Leave your little your little ghost friends like, don't look at me, but I'm going to follow you. Don't look at me. <laughs> but you're so cute. Out. Don't look at me. <laughs> no. I love that they've got like the really no. sad face, but they still seem to be enjoying themselves. Yeah, he's he's following you around. Okay, I know where the door is. It's just a little bit below the knife. Hmm. Are you not picking up the knife? Uh, I did get the knife. It just stays there. Oh, it stays there. I was like, you know, yeah, like... I get a copy of it. Okay, that's right. I forgot about that. Oh, you get the effect, but it's still a. <laughs> so... I had to let Ghosty catch up. The ghost got, he got a little distracted. Ghost is like, I wonder if I can pick up knife. No, still ethereal. Aww. Oh, thank you for linking that, Zarf. <laughs> oh, yeah, awesome. Yeah, that's my stupid, uh, <laughs> what I do with my time. <laughs> I'm amazed how good of a Napsub look you made. <laughs> like, just... that's just a perfect rendition of them. I will have to watch that later. Yeah, uh, they, um, they're hanging off of the, the temperature changer in my house right now because I hung up all those glittery eyeball ornaments, but, <laughs> uh, they stayed up for a while, uh, above my desk, and they spook me, actually, whenever I'd go in there, I'd just <laughs> do a little, like, oh, and then I'm like, oh, right, oh, it's naps to look. It's just naps to look. I've never right, played buddy. I don't know if you can follow me in here. Or any of the Mother series games, but I really liked Undertale, so. Mm, yeah, I would say there's definitely inspiration from Earthbound in Undertale. I've seen well, a lot of people say that it also gets all, as much, if not more, inspiration from the Paper Mario games. Ah! Uh, mm. I can see that. Like, uh, similar to Cucumber Quest which the creator of had uh, in some help with Undyne's design, if I recall correctly. <laughs> yes, sir, if it yes. was the thermostat. <laughs> it was the thermostat. The temperature changey thing. The temperature changer. <laughs> that oh my reminds God. me of when I was trying to remember how the heck to say fuel gauge, and I said the gasometer. <laughs> <laughs> yes! I remember. <laughs> <laughs> oh, that was that was embarrassing. It's like I know what these things are. I see them every day, but I can't I like, cannot remember what they're called. It's, Look it's at not that face blocks. Oh, <laughs> you're still laughing about it, Val. Yes, I am. <laughs> you know, the yeah, gasometer. The gasometer. <laughs> the gasomatic. <laughs> Uh, excuse me, the proper pronunciation is gasometer. Oh, sorry. I think you're right. <laughs> <laughs> like chronometer. Or stinkometer. Yeah, see, show's with me. I'm with you, show. We're friends now. <laughs> <laughs> Can't remember like, every word in the English language. <laughs> to be fair, as long as you get your point across, it doesn't matter if you use the technical right word. Oh, it's totally this, true. Isn't this the place or is it? Oh, oh my, my god. god! Seizure warning. Ah! Uh, oh, look away! Look away! If oh, you, I'm sorry. You have trouble with I this. forgot well, that this game does that. It's okay. Uh, yeah. Okay, I can leave. Okay, give people a little warning. And I. Then... To be fair, I had no idea, but I'll try. I'll try my best. Yeah. Mm -hmm. Actually, was... let's. Um. Oh, I can't really do editing, and YouTube editing sucks butts. Because oh, I'd like to put up, like, a little seizure warning thing right before that. Annotations. I'll record the time and see what I can do. Yeah, oh, maybe annotations. an annotation. Yeah, an annotation okay, would okay. be fine. So, <laughs> one... It's around 124. Yeah. And now, okay, everybody in chat knows now, so if, if they have trouble with it, they can just listen to the beautiful sounds of our voices and look away from the screen. <laughs> the not-so-beautiful sound of my voice. <laughs> Your voice is beautiful. Beautiful uh, voice. You do have a lovely voice, Val. You're a regular Ariel. <laughs> uh, <laughs> uh, <laughs> Val is now blanket. <laughs> Start a musical. <laughs> um, I'm gonna go back to stoplight for a bit. Isn't the place where you can get near the party and then get really sad around here? 
Oh, yes, it is. It is. You can make your way up through the, the wibbly wooby vines. <laughs> also, um, this area reminds me of one of my favorite areas in Dot Flow, which is the the underwater mountain. Mm. It's just it's so quiet and peaceful there. And I actually have a really lovely picture that I use as my phone background a lot. Oh. Yeah, the color scheme in this area is so chill and nice, like, desaturated compared to the rest of the game. Yeah. And then you get the seizure room. Yeah. And then you get into the seizure room. Those plant yeah. things remind me of the aliens from Metal Slug. Oh yeah, with their spaghetti noodly arms that just mm -hmm. move all over the place. Spaghetti mm -hmm. monsters. Spagoobly arms. <laughs> I really like those aliens, even if they're hyper violent and murder me more often than I manage to kill them. <laughs> oh my goodness. Let's leave it alone, Onion. Video games. Video uh -oh. games. Games of the video. Mm-hmm. <laughs> what can you do? Death to the video games, all hail the new flesh. <laughs> <laughs> that sounds like something to be Windows 98 tips and tricks. <laughs> or no, it's Windows 95, my bad. Oh no, I hope Windows 95 didn't hear that. <laughs> I don't think Windows 95 can hear anything anymore. Uh, that's a good point, Prince of Light 99. We are ruining the ambience, but it's Aww. all good. Yeah, I suppose we could all just mute ourselves. <laughs> Everybody shut up for the rest of the stream. No, please. Yeah. Don't. Sure. Here, let's let's have five seconds of, of uh, commemorative science for the ambience in this area. Okay. Was that five seconds? <laughs> yep. Hey, there it is. Oh, that was rough. <laughs> Pleasing everybody. Oof. I almost exploded. Oh, wow. <laughs> I am that would have been full... loud. That would have ruined the ambience. <laughs> I know. That would have been even worse. I even oh, we're almost at the party. <gasps> the sad party. You, unfortunately, you can't hear the music, but it's like super upbeat and happy. And then I can't... Can't join oh, them. So close. Why can't I get past these vines, my friends? No. At least oh, I can stop them from having fun. Look at fun. the picnic. Look at the tiny rice balls oh, and the yeah. bentos. You mean donuts? Oh, sorry. Yeah, jelly donuts. And cheeseburgers. <laughs> and cheeseburgers. <laughs> Eat your cheeseburger, Apollo. <laughs> Thank you, I remember, awkward zombie. Even as a child, I was, and I didn't know what a rice ball was when I was watching Pokemon. I still was like, what the fuck? Like, that's not a donut. <laughs> what are they talking about? What's that black thing on it? That's that's the donut grabber. That's where you grab the donut so you don't get your fingers all messy. <laughs> the donut grabber. <laughs> I'll never know what it's like to have friends. <laughs> oh. Chat, what's your favorite kind of donuts? Favorite donuts, Ooh. chat. Um, okay, we should list off ours as well. Yeah, I'm gonna say fair. sour cream glazed donuts. Oh, is, especially if you combine that with coffee, it is the most wonderful flavor combination. Uh, I like the the ones that are like have like they're kind of long and have whipped cream in them. Oh, the um like long johns. Long johns. Yeah. <laughs> I personally am a Dunkin' Donuts, just plain glazed, warm, fresh, dun or not mm -hmm. Dunkin' Donuts. Uh, Krispy Kremes, my apologies. Krispy Kreme Donuts. I would say Timbits, but they make me really sick, so. Uh-oh. <laughs> oh, that's unfortunate. Yeah. Let's see. What are the chats saying? Prince of Light says Boston Cream, and then Zarf says Bavarian Cream. Are cinnamon rolls Boston. donuts? Custard? Sure. No, <laughs> those are pastries. I, I will accept yeah. cinnamon donuts. I was going to say they're kind of like they're pastries. Not donuts. Onion doesn't oh, like gosh. donuts. Onion, we're trying to help you out here, man. <laughs> onion, onion, just 
put it on. Do you like onions? Onion, do you like onions? I'm assuming Play you along, like pal. <laughs> <laughs> Take it from me, little buddy. <laughs> Hjort Kairi. Oh, I probably <gasps> slaughtered that. Says, ones that are nearest to me at any given moment, which I approve of. Hmm. That's a fair answer. <laughs> Such are you okay, rage. though? Rage. Rage out of my I bumped into my desk. Okay. <laughs> <an> accident. <laughs> My desk has a little slidey out thing, and if I bump it, slidey out thing. Is it like a like a drawer too. slash table? <laughs> and I totally called you on. <laughs> I did it. You know the multicolored flashy light thing that makes cars not car. Yes. Yeah, that makes cars not car. <laughs> Oh, what's, what's really cool about this area is you go from an enclosed space to an open looping space like this. And it's like, how did they do that? Oh, Probably just by blocking you in with objects, but still. Uh -huh. I think so. I think that was the case. Anything that's deep fried.